Okay, so uh, now I will uh, show you uh, the wave propagation in sea ice that we can see from uh, synthetic aperture radar. So this is the view of the Arctic Ocean. So uh, you have the uh, you have the the ice uh, concentration in the background that you see in white and bluish when the concentration is getting toward zero. So this gives you an idea of the ice edge at low resolution. And then if you start to, uh, to zoom in, you see that the, the SAR has a quite uh, distinct uh, signal uh, over the sea ice. So we see clearly the, the sea ice edge. And if you, uh, if you look uh, even closer, you start to see this, uh, this wave pattern entering the, the sea ice and somehow uh, disappearing at some point when the sea ice uh, starts to get too, uh, too stiff. So this is an indication of the marginal ice zone, which is the, the area where the waves are able to travel in the sea ice. This is the definition of the marginal ice zone. And you can see uh, quite different uh, uh, penetration of the waves in the marginal ice zone, depending on the on the type of ice. So in some area it's very uh, uh, very short distance, the attenuation is very fast and on some other area that I show here you can have some propagation of uh, waves in the sea ice over uh, hundreds of kilometers. So this, uh, this is not used operationally but uh, should give you an indication of the ability to, to navigate in the sea ice. So this is one of the emerging and the growing application of a synthetic aperture radar in the Arctic. Uh, it's really to be able to, uh, to identify the area where navigation will be possible uh, or not. So here uh, you see clearly that uh, with this uh, polygon that uh, I light the, the presence of uh, waves in the sea ice, that it's uh, really uh, not uh, evenly distributed. Uh, with the distance of the sea ice edge. It's really dependent on the, uh, the stiffness and probably the thickness of the, of the sea ice. So this is something we, uh, we are looking in the future to develop more uh, some algorithms to automatically detect the waves uh, uh, reaching the polar regions in the sea ice.